have a large bolt stoke. That little guy is crimson. Will I am get your hall? The nines. In this is it's all Ben's here. And tonight I'm... The him? Just what do you think you are doing? Oh, why, if it isn't my fifth cousin thrice removed, Sir Hubert. I was just regaling these fine people with a tail. That is my place. Kindly remove your rotund bottom from my chair. Of course, of course. You've just been absent for so long. Well, I'm here now. You are? I didn't mean to step on your dainty toes. Please proceed. <laughs> you think they all, they are dainty, aren't they? <clears throat> I am Sir Hubert Donald Redkin Fievel Jonathan Swallowsworth Nathaniel Nicholas Columbus Chevrolet David Norwell Esquire the third. And You've th added some names, cousin. Yes, yes, yes. I know not what you speak of. Kindly shove off, will you? <laughs> this is It's All Band Theatre, and I am your humble host, your stalwart storyteller, and unlike the juvenile yarns my cousin likely spun for you in my absence, I have one today of the utmost class. I proudly present the definitive version of Macbeth. Oh, the Scottish play. Yes, yes, they all know it's the Scottish play. Right, but you're not supposed to say the title in a theater, and this is basically a theater set. And now, the Scottish play. <clears throat> we begin on a moor. Three ladies gather on a moonlit eve. Lady Macbeth, we're here! Sisters, thank you for gathering tonight. Of course, it's such a lovely evening. Why have you summoned us, sister? My dote husband is not ambitious. We must light a fire under him that he may seek his true potential. Oh, I love fire. But does he not lack the dominant will to do so? That is why we are here. We will trick him, the weak-minded fool, into doing what I want. Oh, fun. Wise. <laughs> Join me, sisters, and we shall cast a spell. Um, uh, we, we, we don't know any. Yeah, yeah, see, that, that, that is the trick. Oh. We must seem like fate, powerful enough to see into the future. Quick, he approaches. I shall put my hood up to hide thy face. Thou shalt do the same and repeat after me. Double, double, toil and trouble. Double, double, double toil and trouble. Fire burn and come drum bubble. Fire burn and cauldron bubble. I am newt and toe of frog, wool of bat and tongue of dog. I have a newt and toe yes. so long. What was it again? Oh, long hold, hold it. He approaches. Okay, together now. Double, double, double toil, toil and trouble. Fire burn and cauldron bubble. <laughs> Which is, we should turn back, Mac, uh, Scottish guy. As you will know, Banquo, my name is Macbeth. <laughs> and I will not turn back at the sight of three hags with a pot. Hags? I am not a hag. It's not a pot. <laughs> we are. Are not witches. It's a cauldron. We are fates. <laughs> we can see into the future. Oh, ho, ho. and what is my future then? Oh, joy and happiness. Really? Oh, yes, yes. You will be named uh, mm, Thane of Caldor. What's a Thane? Yes, uh, 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 then, uh, uh, then, then you will be king. M mighty king. Uh, me? A king? Oh, well, that's fun. Uh, what about me? What's my future? Mm -hmm. Well, it's hard to You're so to be king. Uh, but, 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 uh, uh, <clears throat> are you sure, sister? Yeah. That, that's yes. actually what you say. Yes. That's my husband. Oh, my, uh, he's this man over here. Uh -huh. Will be, uh, he'll have sons who will be mighty kings. Oh, more kings. How exciting. Your words are interesting. Thank you. But, uh, 
I can't believe I would ever be. <laughs> Telegram for Macbeth, the Scottish guy. Uh, yeah, 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 sure. You're, you're Macbeth, the Scottish guy. Yes, I'm Macbeth. What is it? You've just been made a thane of Cowdor. Shit, really? <laughs> <laughs> My tip. Oh, uh, yeah, sure. All uh, right. There you go, laddie. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I cannot believe it. I believe it. Our words shall come to pass. Yes, yes. And you shall fear no man born of woman, what? nor woman born of woman. Really, no person born of woman shall you have cause uh, to uh, fear. Uh, 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 what? Uh, uh, what now? I shan't. No, you shan't. I, I think you may want to leave the forecasting to me, sister. You seem the Yes, little well, this of... has been entertaining. Let us not depart these weird sisters. I am rather tired from the battle we just fought. It will be nice to return to thine bed and thy noble lady wife. <laughs> <laughs> nice to meet you three, uh, Take care now. Uh, goodbye. Remember our words. They shall come to pass. As soon as the two men are gone. Sons of kings, Sarah's late. <laughs> what? You gave your husband a calling. Why can't I provide mine with one? You're such a great oh, mother wow. and a wife, Mary. Thanks, Sarah. <laughs> I really appreciate that. I love you. I love you. <laughs> Alas, our heroes, Macbeth and Banquo, were not so near their home, and so they had to stay the night at the castle of King Duncan. Ah, it was so nice of King Duncan to put us up, was it not? Oh, very nice. He's a swell guy. Well, I'm going to go get some shut-eye. As will I. But first, I must write to my dearest and inform her of the day's events. It's kind of late, and you're going to see her till in the morrow. And ah, I cannot wait another moment to let her know she's destined to be queen. Right, queen. I'm going to bed. <laughs> <laughs> telegram boy! Boy! Telegram boy! You're called. Yes, take a message to my wife at once. Tell her I'm staying with King Duncan this night and shall return to her loving embrace on the morrow. For sure thing, Fera. <laughs> what? Back so soon? I have her reply. Oh, re really? Well, speak it to me, lad. She says to kill the king. Kill the king? <laughs> you must be mistaken. That's what she said. Now I've got to go. Something wicked this way comes. <laughs> Hmm, the telegram boy must have been in error. I cannot do such a treacherous deed. It would be an act most heinous. But you must have. But Lady Macbeth, you're here! <laughs> I, I had to come. I, I had to make sure you did what was necessary. But, but is it really necessary to commit a regicide? Uh, Fair is foul, and foul is fair. <laughs> Besides, a real man would do it. <gasps> you wound me. I am a real man. Well, prove it. Kill. Kill the king and take his title, thus fulfilling the prophecy that you told me of thine tel telegraph that... Those wise and beautiful women on the more bestowed upon thee. Mm. I shall do it this very night. But, uh, what if I should be caught? Oh, do not worry about that. I am framing the Chamberlains. Just go stab him and be done with it. All right, all right. I shall do as thy noble and beauteous wife commands. And so Macbeth crept into the chamber of the sleeping king. Jeez, oh, snores like a wounded hog, this one. Oh, alas, I do not know if I can pursue this course. 
He looks so fair and innocent whilst he slumbers. <clears throat> then again, my lady wife bid me to do it, and she is always right, so I must ah, stab at thee! <clears throat> There, tis done. I hope dear Lady Macbeth held up her role in the bargain and provided thy alibi. Nearby. Oh. You are both so handsome. Yeah, handsome. Hello, hello. You two ain't so bad yourself. Oh. <laughs> Mayest I sit on your lap? Ooh, of course you may. Climb up here. Uh, may I, uh, sitteth on your lap, too? Uh, I guess so. There! Oh, oh. Comfy, aren't we? Oh, here, have some more nectar of the vine. Don't mind if I do! So, tell me, what oh. made you want to get into chamber linning? Yeah, well, my father <laughs> wanted me to be a shit shoveler, like himself, but I always hated the smell. So I set me sights higher. Oh my. Ooh, ambitious. <laughs> and you? Less dangerous than being a knight. Oh, knights are so brave. But well, Chamberlains are brave, too. So, so brave oh. and, and handsome. We are so handsome. Oh, uh, well, thank you. So you want to see the chamber me manage? Uh, why would I want to see that? Yes, yes, we very much do. Oh, yes, we do. But first, more wine. Yes, more drink wine. the wine. Please. Yes. It's not poison. Right now. <laughs> yes. This is an excellent vintage, but I think I'm a mm. bit sleepy. Uh, me as well, governor. That just uh. means you need more. Get yes, more yes, there. more. Let's keep the party going. All right, well, let's... Oh, excuse me. I'm just going gonna to rest my eyes. Oh, okay. For a quick little nip. <laughs> They're asleep! <laughs> Let us plant the, the bloody daggers and thy lady bid and be gone. Sure, but first, I want some wine. No, it's drugged, remember? Oh, right. Hurry up. This made me feel icky. I need to get back to my good husband and strapping young sons who would not approve of my wicked actions. All right. But it was so much fun, wasn't it, sister? It was, I it oh, I do love to run amok. Amok, 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 amok. The next day... Good morning. Macduff, what are you doing here? Hark, Macbeth. I have called thee all together because a horrible deed was done in this castle last eve. Really? What was it? I slept like a baby. Didn't hear a thing. Aha. Oh. Uh -huh. And, uh, do you have an alibi that can back that up, Bunko? Oh, just thine wife, Mary. <laughs> Nor did I hear anything, uh, a good Banquo. What has happened, Macduff? Well, Lady Macbeth, King Duncan has been slain <gasps> in his bedchamber oh. most brutal. Oh, my! Who would commit such a vicious and ignoble crime? I do not know. But I vow I shall uncover the foul traitor who would do this violence on his beloved personage and bring him to justice. So whatever we can do to help, just let us know. Uh, yes, uh, most assuredly. Uh, I am here for you. Uh, whatever thou shalt need. Oh, that is good to hear, lads. I need all the help I can get. Anyone could be a suspect, even the people right now in well, this well, very did, room. Well, did, did you ask the... Chamberlains? <laughs> I'm having them brought down at once for questioning. Ah, here they are. What's going on? Hi, <laughs> <laughs> <Hey>, everyone. <laughs> Someone has murdered your king. Oh, my God. That's all. Where was the two of you when thy foul deed occurred? But we were just passed out <gasps> in the. Daggers on thy personage! Uh, what? Oh no, how'd I get there? I swear, I've never seen this before in my life! We will take you two into custody at once for questioning. If you truly to do kill not... them! Kill them, husband! Kill them in a rage for what they have done! Pardon? 
You must take revenge for the murder of your dearest friend, King Duncan. Wow, I, I didn't know you two were that close. Yes. Uh, yeah, uh, he was my bestie. F. Mm-hmm. Uh, I am so, so very irate. Uh, yeah, girl. Yeah. Well, yeah. wait, I mean, we didn't do any. Wait, well, the, the other one, quickly. <laughs> what? Uh, but he's right, we d- Ah, <laughs> oh, there. Justice has been served. I really wish you hadn't done that, Macbeth. Oh. <laughs> there are procedures for this sort of thing. Uh, well, uh, see, he, he had to, Macduff. I mean, his loyalty to his league was, it was just too great to be denied. Guess that checks out. Mm-hmm. Well, <laughs> let's find Duncan's heir and crown him then. Breaking news bulletin, the sons of King Duncan have fled. I thought you just did telegrams. Yeah, I do whatever I'm paid to do. It's a living. <laughs> now, why would the boys have run away? Perhaps they were scared. Whoever killed their father would murder them next. No, it is a sign of their guilt. They must have arranged their father's death. Oh, regicide and patricide. Oh, my goodness, how horrendous. Uh, Something doesn't add up here. I'm going to investigate this a bit more. Macbeth, you mind serving as a temporary king in the meantime? Me? Uh, I I mean, uh, uh, I uh, don't know if... uh... Yes, he'll be delighted. Thank you, good Macduff. No problem. I'm glad there's a man here I can trust to look over the kingdom for the moment. I shall return forthwith. Man, you certainly have the luck. Well, I'm going to check on my lady wife. She must be so scared. Oh, scared. (laughs) Well, um, this is quite the turn of events. It is indeed. Well, we already know how this will play out. Do we? Husband? Yes, the witches. Oh, those beautiful fakes you made. Yes, yes, yes. They said that I would be king, and then they said that Banquo's sons would be kings. So I surmised I will just sit the throne temporarily, and then one of them will be anointed. No, no, no. You, you cannot let this happen. Yeah, it's prophesied. I did not see what I could do to change it. Kill Banquo's son. That seems rather harsh. Well, it will, <laughs> it will ensure that you remain king. But Banquo's like a brother to me. I cannot do such a thing. Kill him and, and his lady wife. You know, as well, I mean, you, they may have to mourn. We wouldn't want that, nor bear other children. I mean, that could threaten your claim. Kill Mary? Your yeah, sister? Of course. I have to say, my love, you seem to be a bit caught up in the moment. Well, uh, maybe we should take a brief it. respite. Uh, please? <laughs> All right, all right. I shall kill them dead. But what if Macduff should catch me? Oh, right. The third witch said, I shall fear no person born of woman. Answered my own question. <laughs> yes. Now, now go. You have work to do. I am on it most assuredly. Mm, yes, my dear husband. <laughs> oh, damn it. I have blood on my dress. Oh, oh, oh. Must have come from readying those bloody daggers last night. I hope Macduff didn't see it. Whew. Out! Out, damn spot! Ow! Ow! It won't come out! Oh! I cannot live with myself to be seen wearing a, a bloody dress! Oh, therefore, I must commit suicide! <laughs> Oh! <laughs> Who would have told me to have so much blood in thine body? Alas! It has now spilled. <laughs> Oh! <laughs> 
<laughs> and so, it isn't long before Macbeth kills everyone. No! Husband, no! Except for me, yay! Oh, telegram boy! Yes, ma'am. I need you to deliver something. What is it? Pleasure to me. Ooh, right away, miss. <laughs> <laughs> and Macduff catches up to Macbeth. I have you now, Macbeth. Ah, ye cannot hurt me, Macduff. The witches foretold it. <laughs> witches? We found witch costumes in the closet of your wife and her sisters. She was behind it and manipulated you the whole time. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> well, I guess they were lying then when they said that uh, I need not fear any person born of woman. Ah, uh, uh, well, I was a C-section baby, so I'm not sure I qualify as born of woman, at least not by the definition of today. Eh. Not that that matters now. Any final words before I behead you for your crimes? Yes, I suppose I can come up with something appropriate without haste. <clears throat> out, out, brief candle, lives but a walking shadow, a poor player that struts and frets his hour upon the stage that is heard no more. I, I, yeah, enough of that nonsense. <laughs> for justice! Oh. oh, so that's what my arse looks like from the back. <laughs> uh, someone clean that up. And so thus ends the tragedy of the Macbeth. Play. <laughs> oh, yes, quite. The moral of the story, of course, is never listen to your wife. <laughs> I have been Sir Hubert Donald Redigan Fivel Jonathan Swallowsworth Nathaniel Nicholas Columbus Chevrolet David Norwell Esquire the third and this was It's All Been Theatre a good night It's All Been Done Radio Hour number 447 It's All Been Theatre episode 17 Macbeth This episode was written by Jerome Rutzel and was directed by Kristen Green. It starred Dan Kondo as Sir Hubert and Macbeth, Shane Stefanchek as Archduke Edmund and Benquo, Lady Macbeth as Julie Whitney Scott, Sarah as Kristen Green, Mary as Grace Wilson, Telegram Boy as Joe Morales, Chamberlain number one was Nathan Haley, Chamberlain number two was Chase McCants, and Macduff was Beth Murr. The episode was narrated by Darren Essler. Our Foley artist was Megan Overholt. Our technical director is Shane Stefanchek, and our musical director is Kristen Green. Theme songs were composed by Nathan Haley and lyrics by Jerome Wetzel. This podcast was edited by Jerome Wetzel. Check out our website, iabdpresents.com, and we want to thank Boxland as our host performance space. It's All Been Done presents... Who's Got the Time? <laughs>